So here we have Bubby and we have Jax and we took out all the toys. All the toys are in, all the walls are in the, that area there because um, we don't want Jax to, to have any toy um, possession or obsessiveness and now he's barking because he wants the toys. So we want him to socialize and play without the stress of toys. And, um, and honestly, the interaction with Bubby is actually going pretty well so far. Matt and I are both here in the run supervising play. And Bubby's a young dog as well, and we thought that they would be a good match for each other. And without the toys, it appears that this is okay. And uh, this is really great for Jax and Bubby. So, sometimes, you know, if a dog shows any type of um, toy or object obsession, or they start resource guarding with toys, um, you have to just remove the toys from the equation. And it could really make their socialization much more pleasurable. So Jax, you see, he wants the, the objects, but we're, we're not going to let him have them, not while he's socializing uh, with another dog.